In today's video, we're gonna be doing the gun game challenge. And with this challenge, this is probably one of the hardest ones I've ever done. But the loot you get is completely random and it's actually so much fun. So let's get into the video. So how this challenge works is I'm allowed to pick up one gun to start this game off. And whenever I get a kill with that gun, I have to drop it. And then I have to pick up all the other person's loot, even if they have complete terrible loot. I don't know why, but for some reason, the first gun I decided to pick up was the red eye assault rifle, which is literally my worst gun and I absolutely hate it. But there's a guy over here and let's, we're about to get him. No, but if we kill this guy, oh crap. Okay, well we got some guy. So now we're gonna have to drop the red eye and then we're gonna have to run over there and pick up all his loot. Now, hopefully he actually had a gun that we can pick up. Uh-oh, but there's literally a guy shooting at us. Run, get to his loot. Yes, he had a shotgun. Get inside, get inside. Um, boom. Boom! Let's go. So what did this guy have for us? Uh, he had the downgraded version of the shotgun we just had. Okay, well, that's pretty cool, I guess. Now, with this challenge as well is we're not allowed to pick up any heals or anything we find on the ground. So heals have to be completely picked up from the person we killed, which makes this challenge like 300,000 times harder than it already was. Yeah. This is gonna be a very fun, but also difficult challenge. So let's absolutely destroy this guy. And hopefully he had some shield for us and he did. Let's go. But he also had a freaking red eye assault rifle, which is like the worst gun in the game. Now, I hear bullets to the east-southeast part, so we're gonna totally post up on this little, like, sheet metal and actually spray this guy down. Okay, what did he have for us? I don't know if he had that green SMG, so we're gonna just drop it just to be safe, because I don't want to be caught cheating here. Now, it looks like we have someone completely running to the very edge of the map. I don't know what their thoughts are, but we're gonna go follow them, because I want to get their loot. Now, where the heck did this guy go? Okay, let's talk a little bit more normal. Why is he, like, posted up looking at, like, the seascape? <laughs> What's he want to do? Be a fisherman? Ah! Well, regardless, he totally bit the dust, and he actually had a lot of good loot for us. Now, we have a nice shotgun. And we have a Twin Mag SMG with a flopper and jellies. I'm sorry, Jelly, but I cannot put your jelly on my belly today. Whoa, more bullets. Gosh, there's so many guys over this area. Oh, this has to be a bot. I mean, he's getting absolutely destroyed by my freaking shotgun. And hello, you're dead. Now we have to drop all our loot and see what kind of loot this guy had. And he had... Actually, he had pretty good loot. And he had a big shield for us, which is absolutely awesome because, as you can see, we're 35 away from actually being full shield. So, this is going to put it to the edge, and we're going to continue moving and following our heart. Bruh. We just stumbled upon a llama, and we're going to shoot it a little bit so it can at least spawn a rift for us, and we can pick up the ammo it has. But, we're not allowed to pick up the shields because if we pick up the shields, that would totally be cheating. And we don't want to be caught cheaters. I hate being called a cheater. Cheeto, cheeto, pumpkin eater. Now, let's work our way back over to where the llama's going to die and spawn a rift because I guess they die and spawn a rifts. We're totally going to go there, take the rift, maybe land on some fool to destroy with our awesome pistol and uh, totally crazy crap and totally tactical uh freaking ar yeah right so let's yeah and when it gets closer to the end game of course we're gonna get better and better loot because that's just how people do it they just get better loot at the end of the game and there's a guy right here that we're totally gonna land on so let's totally kill this guy holy crap guys this guy had the mo jackpot huh 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 Oh my god, did he just get sniped? Wait, is there, a, is there a sniper around here? Wait, who is sniping this guy? Is it, is it this bot at this little, like, outpost area? All right, let's get this guy. Now, do we want to kill this guy? Yeah, we're going to do it. Ah, honestly, what would have been smart? Kept the loot I had and waited till the last guy to kill him with the great loot. Because now our loot is quite atrocious. I mean, we just went from purple to literally green. Our loot is kind of bad now. And there's another guy here. Maybe he has some better loot for us. Wait, what is that? Wait, are you joking? He only had a common Havoc pump shotgun? Oh, God. Oh, my God. And where did this Goku go? Oh crap, there he is. What? Totally behind the thing. Hey guys, we have to get out of here. Actually, we might die in this storm if he hits us again. All right. Is there any cars here? No, no cars. Well, it was nice knowing you, I guess. Corn. Bruh. I'm gonna be called a cheater, but I'm totally gonna eat this corn. Okay, let's eat the corn, eat the corn, eat the corn. We might actually be able to get out, but he's right in front of us, kinetic blading on top of a freaking tree. Oh crap, guys. This is gonna get really dicey in about 16 seconds. Okay, guys, I think we're gonna be... Oh, no, no! No! Oh, 
we would have hit our shots, we totally would have killed him. Ah, we're back with another attempt and we're gonna go to the citadel this time and at the citadel hopefully we can actually get a dub or at least do way better than we did last time and kill a freaking guy if he's shooting at us i have a gun but if i kill this guy i literally won't be able to have any guns so i have to wait for him to pick up a gun all right now we can kill him all right easy peasy we just picked up his shotgun which was literally an upgrade of ours and there's another guy in here oh god oh god oh god ah. Okay, quickly, I uh, guess we're, we're going up the line of upgrading our shotgun, baby. Let's go. Okay, we don't have much health, which means we're gonna have to play this really cautiously and hopefully get a kill with someone who has meds. And maybe this Aaron Yeager does. No, but we're back to our old green shotgun. And hello, Mr. Friend. Glad to see you back in my inventory. Nice. Now we just kind of need to go get some heals or kill someone who has heals so we can heal up. <laughs> All right, we're at the top of the Citadel right now. And at the top of the Citadel, I see a guy. Okay, if we can hit this guy and actually do a crap ton of damage and kill him, he might have a gun for us. Where is he? Where is he? No! Who killed him? Who is this guy in the freaking little village? God! He's making life so much harder. Oh, crap. Who the heck is this guy? Okay, maybe this guy has some heals for us. Okay, let's go see. Hello, did you have any loot for me? And you had a red eye assault rifle, just like everyone does. I absolutely hate this gun. Oh, is that him? 170-ish? Yes, nice. Looks like he had a kinetic blade for us too. Let's go. Okay, we need to quickly pick up all this guy's loot and get the crap out of here. Someone has ODM gear and they're like right behind me. So yeah, we're running. Okay, this guy didn't have any shields for us, but he did have 10 bandages. And with 10 bandages, we're gonna be a little bit better shaped than we would be if we had no bandages. We've healed up a little bit and we have okay loot. Man, this guy's just swinging around like Tarzan. I think he's totally looking for me right now. Holy crap, there's guys everywhere around here. Come down here, I dare you. I'll blow your head off. All right, we're making our move, and we're getting out of the Citadel. I don't know if that guy's still there and everybody wants to kill me or not, but we're going to totally swim down this little river and hopefully get away from anybody who might be wanting to kill us. If we can get to Anvil Square, kind of post up, maybe catch someone off by surprise and get a nasty kill, then we can maybe get some better loot. Or at least some shield. Because right now, having no shield kind of sucks and is a little bit scary. All right, let's get in this whip and go see if we can find somebody to get. Well, I hear bullets east, so... Ah, ah. I hate when that happens. Let's go investigate and see if we can maybe pop some shots off, even though we have an SMG and a shotgun, which is literally all close range. So popping shots is quite literally the most useless thing we could do. Why would I even consider it? You pathetic loser. Why would you suggest that? Get on the bike. I'm sorry, guys. My rage monster just seriously took over me and this guy's actually shooting me and we need to get the crap out of there now. Uh, I don't know who that guy was, but his accuracy obviously is the best accuracy in the world if he's hitting us while we're going supersonic with a literal super fast bite what we're gonna do now first is heal up with these bandages and no 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 that's how your car doesn't fall off a cliff take notes from cicada place now that we're healed up i think it's our mission to go get some better loot because the circle is getting smaller and there's only 19 people left and at this point in the game i'm gonna need some better loot if i want any chance of winning this game either we win or we lose here if we can get a kill we'll be in great shape and is that a guy over there yes it is okay take the zip line get him get him get him get him 70 damage 70 again Come on, where is he? No! 5 HP! Uh, no! Oh, wait! And he has the chug gunner? No! I wish I would have killed this guy! God dang it! Thank you guys so much for watching the gun game video. If you want to see me do this again, and if you guys enjoyed, make sure to subscribe and lather up that like button. Cicada plays out!